Good morning. Um, travel day today across to our, to our next match venue at, at Kamoshi. Um, you know, this next important game for us against against Uruguay. It's really important that we regroup after after yesterday and and put in a really strong strong performance against Uruguay. You know, with um, three games to go, we we need we need to win these last three games in our pool. You know, we, we take a lot of positives from yesterday's game, and, and particularly in the first half, we, you know, we played really, really well. You know, some some technical things in our game and, and, and some accuracy around certain areas that let us down. We'll, we'll be certainly working on rectifying those. We know that the Uruguay, Georgia, and Wales will certainly come with us with the line out more, so we're going to have to really tighten up our, our more defence. But, but I think you know, there's there's a lot of positives out of yesterday as well. Um, you know, it's always difficult with a short turnaround and, and a few people are a bit dinged up from yesterday, but when, when we arrive at our new hotel, it's the great thing, it's on the coast, so the boys will be doing an ocean recovery and, and you know, and then we'll be all, all ready for training on, on Monday. Injuries? Yeah, we've got, we've got some injuries from the game. For Liami Mata, is is tight in his calf, which um, you know, he had to come off at half time. So that was um, a disappointment. He probably won't be won't be recovered in time for Uruguay. Um, Pathaliato had a head injury assessment, which he failed. So it's not possible for him to um, to be right for Uruguay because you know six days is the minimum turnaround with a head injury. So so he'll be out. So we'll have to do a little bit of shuffling in our forward pack. But we certainly you know we'll. Got um, you know some good um, quali- um, quality players there to to be able to cover all, all, all bases.